Hey guys, welcome to Matt and Jack's Protest Music YouTube channel. Today we'll be analyzing the correlation between two popular protest songs, one from the 1960s and one from today. The first song is Bob Dylan's popular hit, Only a Pawn in Their Game. This song was inspired by the shooting of Medgar Evers. Evers was a Mississippi civil rights activist in the 1960s. Evers was unjustly shot by the Ku Klux Klan right outside his home in Jackson, Mississippi. I would like now to introduce the singer from New York, Bob Dylan. The bullet from the back of his bush took Matthew Evers' blood. His finger finally triggered his name. This next song is J. Cole's Be Free. This song was inspired by the shooting of Michael Brown, who was shot multiple times by a police officer after he met the description of a man who robbed a nearby liquor store. Cole released the song in memory of Brown. The shooting led to increased racial tension in Ferguson, Missouri. In an interview with Complex, J. Cole said, I'm tired of it, the shooting of innocent blacks. It's a up. I'm tired of it. Please welcome back Jay Cole, everybody. And I'm in denial. And I 
and it don't take no x-ray to see right through my smile oh no i'll be on the go but it ain't no drink out there that can numb my soul Take the chains off. All we want to do is break the chains off here. Yeah. All we want to do is be free. All we want to do is be free. All we want to do is take the chains off. All we want to do is break the chains off here. Yeah. All we want to do is be free. All we want to do is be Can you tell me why? Every time I step outside, I see my people die. I'm letting you know that it ain't no gun they make that can kill my soul. Oh no. All we want to do is take the chains off. All we want to do is break the chains off. Yeah. All we want to do is be free. All we want to do is be free. All we want to do is take the chains off. All we want to do is break the chains off. Yeah. All we want to do is be free. All we want to do is be free. Celebrated like Obama waited until his last day in office to tell the nation brothers is getting their reparations. Hey, a man can dream, can he? No disrespect in terms of change, I haven't seen any. Maybe he had good intentions, but was stifled by the system and was sad to learn he actually couldn't bring any. That's what I get for thinking. This world is fair. They let a brother steer the ship and never told him that the ship was sinking. But I got other to think about, like my bank account. Forget that watch, you paid too much for it. You ought to be ashamed when brothers back home be dreaded when the seasons change. Cause they ain't got no heat and they ain't got no AC. Walmart distribution fire, my homie, he just had a baby. You wonder why it's been so many B&Es lately. While brothers from the hood shooting like this is TNT lately. And since all the ballers leaving college early, I turn on the TV and don't see no brothers with degrees lately. Are we all alone? Fighting on our own. Please give me a chance. Something's got me down I will stand my ground Don't just stand around Don't just stand around All we want to do is be free All we want to do is be free All we want to do is take the chains off As you can see, both of these artists were inspired by the killings of innocent African Americans. This shows us that even 50 years apart, racial tensions are still very similar. Dylan and Cole both used music as an outlet to express their political and social beliefs on the issues. Make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you.